Yeah. So it's another beautiful brand new day, brand new night, depending on wherever you are watching me from. My name is Jimmy Ruff. Kindly subscribe to his channel, like, comment, and always stay connected. Fun time, bro. Yeah. So my new guy, my guy, uh, last minute has come out with a new song called Pool. Pool. P U U L. Charlie the song, yeah. <laughs> Some in windows that your man fixed in the song, bro. You know, due to copyright reasons, I cannot play it for it, but I want you to go check the song out. The song they be like, you know, Last Minute is actually one of my favorite musicians that have come into the game with a different style. Yeah, I think Black Sheriff came in with a different style, Last Minute is in with a different style, and you know, some couple of other musicians are coming in with a different style, and like, I really appreciate it. Uh, I mean... I really got to, you know, like uh, Last Mid more when he dropped that bad boy. Feeling the vibe, cause no, no, no. Even that one was also my favorite. Feeling the vibe, cause I love my life and 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 and, and, and uh, oh please, I even love my my you are mine. I don't know why I to it. Please don't let me alone. You give my eyes and show me your way. I, 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 you think that I am mad, you don't want me, I'm not okay, but my one don't know, I, 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 hey, child, that song, you know, that's actually one of the songs that I felt I was the one that wrote, like, I was the one that did the song, that was actually one of my songs, and that Black Sharif, uh, fortunes I wish on you, not few, plenty, bundle, I'm looking up for you wherever you are. Wherever you day, if you say my name, I will show. If you call, I'll be on the road. I will stay behind you for life. You are feeling too lost. How long you gonna be a slave to your flaws? If you stay on the floor, I wanna see you on the top of you. Yeah. Like that song, Charlie, it's actually one of my favorite. It's actually one of the songs that I felt like I was the one that wrote it. You know, like Ghana, like we got a talent, just the investment that is needed, bro. We get a talent, just the investment. But before then, I'll go into the, you know, topic for today. I just want you to go check, uh, I'm just urging you to go check the songs out. And uh, my own, my song is still banging, yeah, Charlie. I've dropped a new song, like my track, uh, Never Judge Me, Never Judge Me is still, you know, banging. Go stream it. Please, I just want you to stream it on my YouTube channel, yeah. Jimmy Ruff, Never Judge Me. Like, go check it out. Just go check it out, yeah. So, yeah, let's uh, move straight to today's to topic, yeah. Uh, I don't know why people always kind of think uh, rich people always have to do some dirty stuff to make money. Like, I don't know why. People always have these bad perceptions about rich people. You know, successful people who are like musicians who are really striving hard in the game. You know, actors that are doing well in the game. Uh, footballers, politicians and all those things. I'm not saying it's not true. Like, we have musicians, we have a lot of... Uh, people you know, like we have a lot of series of people that have you know been doing all these kind of you know underground things to you know blow we have a lot of them but we don't have any evidence against them you know we don't have any substantial evidence against what they are doing and even if they are doing it i feel like that's their belief you know there was this day that gara was going to play a football match against one i think that was at the world cup right the day you was entering the park and you know he was praying on uh, his hand like there was a powder in his hand and he was praying as soon as he got to the park he poured it away and people had problem with it and i felt like okay at the end of the day that's what he believes in so you are also a christian you are a muslim when you go to the uh, field you pray to your god and maybe that's the person's also what the person also believes in you understand yeah you have the right to be preaching them but you don't have the right to be condemning you know all these people and even you with all what you're saying you people don't have any concrete evidence against these people you people don't have any concrete evidence concrete you know substantial you know substantive evidence against these people that they are into you know gaming like how do you say they they game nigeria people like louis say recently a video is trending i mean the video is risk it their video is trending and people kind of have this 
mindset that they are they they, they game yeah so like, and you know when they say you are you they game it actually means uh, you are into occultic kind of stuffs I don't know why Africans seem to and I feel like that's one of the reasons why people are not really moving on because they don't believe in hard work people no more believe in hard work they don't believe in working hard and smart they only believe you know that the only way you can make it in this world is you know by doing some stuff like doing some underground stuff which of course like Charlie oh my god that, you know the, like there are things I actually want to say but I, like I wish I could say but I, I I just I'm just trying to you know keep it I'm just trying to keep it but the thing is like you should always you know get rid of this old mindset I'm not saying it's not true that people are not doing things they are doing but we should also believe in hard work you should also believe in all this stuff so the video training was uh risky and the video you know shaking uh hands like they like in two different separate videos risky uh, I think that was risky it was or the video whisk it was actually uh greeting like they were you know these symbols they normally do this kind of greetings they normally do and all those kind of things and people are just creating reading minis into it i remember and it reminds me of that old nigerian movies uh billionaires club whenever they greeted you they do this <laughs> hey challenge love uh, nostalgia nostalgia this is a nostalgic memory bro this is a nostalgic memory uh yeah so like i feel like all because of greetings i remember when i was a child i also invented my own style of greetings and when i went to school and introduced it to my peers like i i told them that, okay this is how we you know this uh my new style of greeting and you know whenever i finish i add this one that symbol and if it was to be that i was a celebrity then or rich then People would have said, okay, these people are into some occultic kind of things. Me actually, like that, I just invented that. I just felt like it was looking very beautiful for me. You understand? So, like, whenever someone greets you, even uh, there was a point in time that even if you were taking a picture and you posed, like, you have this pose, you pose like this, people read meanings into it. Whenever you do this, people read meanings into it. Like, how, bro? And I, I've been doing all these things, but there's nothing like that. Nothing has been happening, bro. Nothing has been happening. I think we should, you know, try to limit this kind of uh, bad mindset we have uh, about our musicians. Niger, and even not only Nigeria, Ghana, America, all over the world. You know, that kind of mindset is around the world. Like, we should just, you know, get rid of all these kind of things and, you know, like it doesn't add up bro it doesn't add up like it doesn't add up it's not too cool bro it's not too cool let's get rid of all these mindset and focus like just support our music you know like these are some of the unnecessary stuff that are going on to the extent that people think you know you can't be in the music industry if you are if you are if if you don't belong to any society and all those things to the extent that people think you can't belong to any you know, like Charlie that these are all you know like it will limit like if you keep thinking this way it will limit your efforts it will always limit your effort bro kindly subscribe to this channel like comment and always stay connected my name is Jimmy Rafa I'll be back with more fun time bro hey why mm -hmm. oh, Lord, who Time. Jimmy Ross. Slot again, see the play on the street with the two things you can't imagine. But boys never play with a high grade. But boys never give up on streets. Depression, killer we as we keep grinding, chasing the mullah. You don't see how when I ice take danger. Never drive my hustle with the bad mind. Let me say I was my street boy, I be good boy, turn bad. Never turn your back on me if you see me in danger. Reality, but nobody say I get a choice. Hey. Even they get to kind of life, you nobody know, say we have a choice. Make you never ever judge me, brother man. Make you never ever judge me, brother man. You know, be God, you know, be God, you know, be God. You know, be God, you know, be God. You know, be God.